<laughs> Anno, uh, you're a French man from Bordeaux and yes. you've been here in Chile for, for 20 years making wine. Why, why do you think Maule is unique or interesting? Well, first of all, uh, Maule is a very traditional wine region. Uh, it's been here forever. And uh, uh, during a long, long time, uh, the wine industry was not considering uh, Maole as a quality region. The, it was known for, you know, huge volume, uh, cheap wine and uh, good and cheap. Uh, 20 years ago, uh, as, as a winery, we start to look for different grapes uh, because we have a big uh, uh, vineyard in, in, in close to Santiago, Cabernet Sauvignon Merlo, and we needed something different. So we start to look around and uh, of course we went to Maole, the biggest uh, wine area, vineyard area. And uh, for us it was a surprise because it's a very traditional uh, vineyard area where you have uh, all vineyard, Senso, Carignan, Pais, uh, also Cabernet Sauvignon. So when we start to look around and we discover, uh, for instance, that Carignan you can see around me, uh, that is around 100 years old, maybe a little bit more, uh, as a Frenchman, you said, uh, for me it was really important to taste it, to try it. And, uh, and uh, the result was amazing, really. In 2001, uh, we, we, we did the first Carignan uh, for Altfiel, and uh, it was a hit. I mean, uh, really the wine was beautiful. And, uh, and, and because of that wine, uh, all the Carignan waves start in Chile. So really for me, Maole and especially Cauquenes is a very important uh, wine region for that aspect, but also because I really believe it's maybe the most traditional uh, region in, in the entire Chile. Mm -hmm. And traditional in what way? I mean, you know, around us we can see all these head-trained old vines. What makes Maule different to other regions in Chile? Maule is not industrial. I mean, if you look at the vineyard, it's bush vine. Uh, we still work uh, a big portion of the vineyard uh, with horses. Uh, you have a lot of small producers. Uh, each producer uh, work its vineyard in own way. I mean, if you're talking about terroir in Chile, I would say Maule, Cauquenes, maybe Itata are, are the re real terroir uh, in, in Chile. That's why.